Hi, I'm in Hobart, Tasmania, which is the capital of Tasmania, the southernmost state of Australia. And it's famous for its fishing, for its dairy products, triple brie cheese, its ice cream, and of course for the Tasmanian Devil, which I've been here a couple times and haven't seen yet. I hear it's pretty rare. Also, it has an interesting history, which if Tasmanians were subject to being a victim, they could be a victim of the past and held in the grip of the past, but they they are evidence that you don't have to allow your past to dictate your future. Their history is in the early 1800s. They were settled by the English as a penal colony. Actually, the worst convicts were sent here to Tasmania, and the way they did it wasn't very pretty at all. And you could look at that and think, well, that's my history, that's who I am. But a great example is you don't have to be locked into, dictated into a negative future because of your past. Let me give you a key of life and how to do that. The Apostle Paul said, this one thing I do, I haven't figured it all out, but this one thing I figured out, forgetting those things which lay behind, I'm pressing on to those things which are ahead. There's the key. He says this one thing. I thought, well, hold it, Paul. You said two things. You said forgetting and pressing on. But actually, it's only one thing because it's one in the self. You can't press on without forgetting. You're going to have to let go of yesterday if you want to press on to tomorrow. And you can't actually let go of yesterday without pressing on to tomorrow. So here's the key. The key to a negative past is a great future. Start to dream of a great future and then begin to step out. And as you begin to step out and do those things that you dream of, the future that you have in front of you, your present becomes your history. And you can change your history. You can change your past. You can change it for the generations to come. We don't have to be dictated to by the past. The best thing about the past is its past. How do you deal with a negative past? A positive future. You can rewrite history today. Just take a look at what you want to do. Dream the dreams you want. Use Tasmania as an example. And don't be locked into yesterday. Have a great future.